Good morning, everybody, on this Monday, October 7th. And I'm trying to get on my, my work computer right now. I'm having some issues, some technical issues. It's not doing what I want it to do. It should be doing what I want it to do. But it is not. I have a second window over here, which is why I'm super blue. That's better. Um, now I'm blue again. <laughs> I just can't win. Um, I don't know what that voice was. Anyway. I, uh, I am trying to get on my computer. It's about 7.45 in the morning. Uh, I am logging off at 4.15 today, come hell or high water. I am tired of giving so many extra hours to work. And I say that now at 7.45 in the morning, but I probably will end up working until five because that's just who I am. Um, but I'm gonna try to get off work as soon as possible. I'm also gonna try to eat um, healthier than I have been. You know, I've been eating kind of whatever the last couple of weeks because I've been on travel and I'm going to try to get back into eating better. Um, I'm going to have my salad and my quesadilla for lunch. My body's used to processing that. Um, I might make some chicken salad later today but I don't know we'll see. And then I don't know what we're going to have for dinner. We're probably going to have steak and cauliflower rice if I had to hazard a guess because we have that here at home. So that's probably what we're going to end up doing. Um, for now, I'm trying to skip breakfast this morning. I'm not super hungry. I am feeling better. If you didn't catch yesterday's vlog, I was not well yesterday. My stomach was very, very upset. It was not a good time. Um, but today I'm feeling better, so that's good. I have a little bit of a residual headache, which could potentially be because I'm getting back into ketosis. I might have kicked myself out of ketosis last week with how much protein and stuff that I was eating. Um, it's definitely a possibility. But today I'm going to try really hard to get my fats up and my carbs down and um, just overall try to eat a little bit healthier today than I have been. And bring my calories back in line. That's the goal. Yesterday I didn't do too bad. Yesterday I think I was at like 1,700 or 1,600. Something like that. Let me look and see if I can bring it up real quick here. It wasn't, it wasn't, I wasn't terrible yesterday. Part of that was because I wasn't feeling well. So I was, I skipped breakfast and pretty much skipped lunch. I was at 1527. So like my lunch was four jellos sugar-free jellos and four polio sticks and then dinner I had a hamburger I ate a lot of dinner I ate 1100 calories of dinner I had a hot dog and two hot dogs and a high hamburger and then a side salad and then when I got home I had a half a carton of enlightened ice cream the keto version of the enlightened ice cream and um, some no better chocolate chips so yeah, 1527 yesterday, which wasn't, too, I'm not too terribly upset about that. I updated my uh, iOS on my phone yes, uh, yes, uh, Saturday night. Yesterday was Sunday, yeah. Saturday night I updated, updated iOS and I am not liking some of the changes that they made. Um, they made some changes to the way the health app works, which annoys me because I've gotten used to it and I and I have been taking my blood sugar yesterday and today that it's been elevated which is why I try got to try to get back on the eating right path um, I've been eating way too much junk um, and I need to do better I need to do a lot better so uh, I gotta get my body back in a rhythm I gotta get back to drinking a ton of water My goal is to drink 32 ounces of water by lunchtime. That should not be a problem at all. So, got to get back into doing what I need to do, basically, is what I'm trying to say. And uh, that's the goal. So, anyway, good morning. It is Monday. I am feeling better physically. I'm still very tired, and I am not wanting to work today. <laughs> You know, my sister tells me, she's like, you know, Jessica, you're so lucky you have a job. You know, I am so sad that I can't work. I would find, she's like, I'm so bored. I would find things to make myself, keep myself busy. Absolutely, would find things to keep myself busy. Um, 
so anyway I am I'd probably do a lot more with YouTube <laughs> if I didn't have to worry about money I would probably do a lot more YouTube videos still do the vlog I would probably do a lot more with um, the uh, Omni Z channel I definitely do a lot more in the way of like answering comments and stuff responding to people interacting with people I would have more time to do that and I would absolutely do that so anyway I'm gonna get to work I'll see y'all later I'm gonna also while I'm working this morning I'm gonna be downloading all of my footage off of my camera which is gonna take a little while so all right I'll see you guys later all right y'all it is later in the evening now it is 6 20 and I'm about to run to Target. I should go to the gym, but I'm not going to. Because I'm lazy. I should. I absolutely should be going to the gym. Neil's going to go to the gym. I'm not going to the gym because I'm lazy. What I am going to do is I have a sock that decided to rip a hole in the bottom of it. I have socks that I've had for a while and they're like one by one getting holes. You know what I mean? Like, I don't throw both socks out when one sock gets a hole. So, <clears throat> I have this sock that doesn't have a hole. And I have this sock that has a hole. So, the holy sock is going in the garbage. And the non-holy sock is going on my foot. So, anyway. Yeah. I'm going to be lazy. I'm going to go to Target and buy some light bulbs. And buy a battery for my remote for my car. And... I might go to Walmart. I don't know. Um, yeah. But we've already eaten dinner. I wrapped up my what I eat in a day today. I'm actually doing really good on calories. I'm only at about 1,200 calories today. My carbs were higher than what they should be. But my calories are good. And my fat came in higher than my protein, which is good. So... <clears throat> anyway, um, tw yeah, 1,205 calories. That's where I ended up. Can you see that? Is it going to focus? There it is. 1,205 calories because I skipped breakfast. If I had eaten breakfast, it would have been 1,500, 1,400, somewhere in there. Anyway, we're going to run to Target. I just wanted to say hello and say that work was done and I'm tired. I want to go to bed early. I'm not going to be able to because it's a wrestling night and that means that they're gonna be up watching wrestling. Neil's gonna go to the gym for hours, even though he said he's exhausted and tired and wants to go to sleep. He's gonna go to the gym for probably two or three hours. For now, I'm gonna go to the Target though. And when I go to Target, I like to putz around, but first and foremost, I'm gonna go for light bulbs and a battery for my remote, so. Yep. I have edited a couple of vlogs. One is um, uploading now. I can only really upload one at a time. So I've got one uploading now. Once that's done, I'll start the next one and then the next one. Because I've I edited three, I think. I'm up to the 30th. So <clears throat> that's what I'm gonna try to focus my time on tonight. I'm not gonna try to, to film any videos. Uh, my keto box came tonight, but I don't think I'm gonna bother filming that today I'll just post it like Friday I already have my full week of eating video that I'm gonna post this week um, <clears throat> I need to edit but I'll just post that uh, unboxing on Friday my target or my keto crate should be here probably by the end of the week as well so yeah I need to film a shop my or a uh, project pan update which I'm planning on filming probably film that tomorrow like I'll film that tomorrow in the keto box unboxing tomorrow tonight I'm just gonna focus on trying to get some videos edited so um yeah but if I film my uh project pan update tomorrow night uh, and then do a foundation review maybe Wednesday or Thursday that should be good all right I'm gonna put the camera down I'm gonna get on the road to Target it's been raining all day that might be playing into the whole like wore out tiredness too so i don't know all right i'm gonna go i'll see you guys later 
All right, you guys, it is quarter after 10 and I was ready to go to sleep two hours ago. <laughs> um, I didn't get any more videos edited, to be honest with you. I just relaxed and laid in bed after we got home from Target. Um, Cause I'm still not feeling, I mean, I'm my stomach's better, but I'm still dealing with a headache. And I'm not 100% certain it might be, sorry, I just realized that there's like a, like a snag in my pill pillowcase and I get distracted easily. Um, I'm concerned that the headache might be uh, the keto flu because I wasn't eating the best last week. I mean, I still stayed low carb for the most part, but I was eating a lot of calories and I was eating higher protein than normal. So I'm sort of thinking that maybe the headache that I'm dealing with yesterday and today might have something to do with keto flu, but the stomach was not keto flu. I guarantee you that because keto flu doesn't include stomach flu. So John just snuck around behind me. I don't know if I caught him on camera or not. <laughs> anyway, it is time for bed. My head hurts. I want to go to sleep. I didn't do anything. Um, I, like I said, we went to Target. I ended up spending, I don't even remember how much, like 60 bucks. Neil decided he wanted a jump rope, so we got him a jump rope for five bucks. And we found a Circulon roasting pan, 50% off. I'm not sure we're going to keep that though. I might take that back. Um, John's like, don't we already have a roasting pan? I'm like, I'm not sure that it's any good because for the long, for a very long time, we did not spend a lot of money on pots and pans. We bought like pretty cheap stuff, to be honest with you. Um, and we've continued to use it. We've, we've used that. I mean, we still have the same dishes that we got when we first got married. Um, yeah. We still have the same uh, plates we bought when we first got married. We got a four, uh, four place set. The bowls are all gone, right? Beth broke the bowls. My sister broke the bowls. Uh, she was emptying the dishwasher and had a seizure and dropped them. So she broke the bowls. But we still have the plates that we got when we first got married. 20-year-old plates. They still work. We still use them. Anyway, um, our roasting pan, I'm concerned, might not be that great. And we saw it. And I said, let's buy it. We can always return it. It's not a big deal. So, um, so yeah, we might return it. We'll see. Um, and then we bought a new battery for my uh, car car remote. And then what else did we buy? That's pretty much it. Vitamins. Yeah. John got some vitamins that he that he likes the uh, hair, skin, and nail vitamins that were was helping him with his his nail his brittle nails. I ended up buying some collagen, just some straight up collagen powder. Um, vanilla flavored. So I mixed it with some unsweetened vanilla almond milk. Tasted fine. Didn't mix up real well. It's powder. I mean, come on. It's, it is what it is. Um, it didn't taste bad. So, um, I was watching somebody who said that taking collagen for them helped with their hair. And I'm very concerned about my hair. So, it's just, it's, I'm just losing way too much of it. And I have been for the last year. So, um, I know biotin's good for hair, collagen. My one a day that I take, what is this? This, this has biotin in it. Yeah, this has biotin in it. I do not think it has collagen in it. It does not. So this does have a thousand MCG. I don't know what MCG stands for. I want to say micrograms, but that's probably not tr not correct. But nonetheless, it's 3,333% of the daily value necessary for biotin. This does not have collagen in it, but I do take this every day. Um, so the collagen is supposed to help with hair as well. So it wasn't bad. I bought some before. I bought a strawberry lemonade flavor before, and I did not like it. I didn't like the flavor of it. Um, this, because it's vanilla flavored, I can mix it in with, um, almond milk. I could also, if I really wanted to, I could sprinkle it on top of, like, ice cream. I don't think that would be bad. I could mix it in with nut butter. 
Um, yeah, I can do a bunch of stuff with it that I can't do with like a strawberry lemonade flavor. So, and I bought some almond milk. So I bought a couple. We bought a couple of things. I forget how much. I think I spent like a hundred bucks again. But like I said, forty of that was the vitamins and the collagen, and then twenty was the the um pan the roasting pan so that's more than half of what we spent right there anyway the reason why we bought john so many vitamins we bought them you take one of those a day or two of those a day one a day so yeah we bought john the for problem all, is that neil likes to take them as well yeah neil they're 60 tab 60 uh they're chewy they're chewables and there's 60 in a bottle and they were on clearance they were 30 percent off 15 percent i don't know they were on clearance they were marked down um, so we bought two bottles, so technically it's like four months worth of vitamins, but like John said, they're, they're actually like a dark chocolate flavored chew and Neil will sneak them when he sees them. So they probably won't last a whole four months, but anyway, that's it for the day. I'm tired. I'm going to go potty. I already brushed my teeth. I brushed my teeth at nine o'clock. I was ready. So I'm just going to go potty. And I'm going to go to bed. That snag on the pillowcase. I don't know if my ring caught it. I don't know if, if that even came there tonight. I don't know how long it's been there. Do you know how long it's been there? I do know. I don't know. We were rough on sheets and pillowcases and stuff too, though. So huh. We have a ton of them. Because of the fact, what, what usually ends up happening is something in the set... Well, we, first of all, we have a ton of pillows. I don't know if you've ever noticed, but John has three pillows. I have three pillows. Um, and then what typically happens is we wash the sheets over and over again, and then they start to get, get very thin, and then they fray. Um, and then we'll have pillowcases left over, or we'll have a top sheet, and the bottom sheet will be, you know, torn or whatever. So if you've ever seen the blankets on the, on the sofas in the living room that we put over top of them to keep, try to help protect them from the dog's scratching the leather and stuff uh, a lot of that is like old sheets and stuff we just put them on there so the dogs don't scratch up the leather it doesn't always work plus the boys don't always keep the blankets on the, the bed they're on the sofas so anyway today I am thankful that I'm feeling better than I was yesterday still not feeling 100% but I'm thankful that I'm feeling better than I was yesterday so that's it I hope today was better than yesterday. I hope tomorrow will be just a little bit better than today. I hope y'all are having a great day and I will see you tomorrow. We also bought light bulbs. That was $20. $25. We also bought light bulbs. Alright, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye.